today I'm going to set up a PHP 8.1 engine X MySQL 8 and PHP my admin on my local development uh, machine using docker and docker compose these are the services defined uh, in the server section there is a, an engine x table alpine image uh, that is listening on port 80 on my local machine and uh, there is an src folder in my development folder that is being bind mounted to var slash ww slash html uh, also there is an nginx folder in my uh, development machine uh, there is an nginx config file that is being bind mounted to replace the default configuration uh, of that nginx uh, stable alpine image this service is depends on php and mysql uh, this is the php a section of my docker compose file uh, this is looking for a file php.docker file under docker folder docker files folder in my development folder i have a docker file files folder inside there is a docker file uh, that is very simple uh, docker file that is pushing Im image uh, pulling image uh, from docker Im hub php 8.1 fpm alpine the working directory is uh, was the same one uh, like before uh, and i'm going to run this command after that uh, this will ensure the mysqli extension is installed and enabled uh, for some reason this command doesn't work for me and this is another folder that is environment variables uh, i have added those in the separate file we have environment variables for mysql and php my admin uh, let's see uh, the next sec also we need to bind mount uh, the our uh, uh, folder development folder src to uh, var slash ww slash uh, delegated uh, for performance reasons and a custom ini to uh, enable uh, many other uh, php settings like uh, increasing file upload limit etc another uh, section is my sql another service is my sql uh, if you are running this on an m1 uh, mac mini like me uh, i first i was tested 5.7 instead of 8 it was not working on md64 so i added platform uh, linux slash x86 64 and it worked so even if you are using 5.7 this line is important if you are using this on an m1 based machine for now uh, after I changed it to MySQL 8, I didn't check, but still I keep that line. If you can, if you are running this on a, an Intel machine, you can completely remove this line. And it is looking for an environment file. Uh, the environment file is uh, here. That is a single line of code, MySQL secret. That's it. Uh, and another one is php my admin php my admin imaging uh, official image is being pulled uh, sorry pushed sorry pulled <laughs> uh, the another one uh, is the, the environment file that is also located here in the env folder uh, these are the default values i grabbed from the php my admin docker hub page uh, so nothing fancy there uh, it's also listening sorry it is listening on the port 81 uh, we are not reverse boxing this and doing this fancy stuff uh, nginx is listening on 80 and this is listening on 81 and in my src folder this is my development setup uh, to make sure this uh, thing is the server the nginx server is working i added uh, one dot png to serve a static file and test the setup and it is working fine this is our custom uh, ini 
uh, it will increase the upload max file size to 4000 m and post max to 4000 m this is a index.php that will use our mysql uh, connection to make sure it is working fine or not and this is a simple uh, file upload script i grab from w3 schools and this will ensure the file uploading etc is working fine so let's test this setup i already uh, this setup is already running so i'm going to stop everything and all you need to do is grab this folder and uh, using a terminal type docker command sorry docker compose app after you installing docker and that's it uh, the service is currently running if you refresh this page as you can see it's connected successfully that means it is successfully made a connection to my sql uh, another one is uh, a file upload test you can add any files uh, like even a bigger file like vs code darwin and test the upload it should work because we already increased the file upload uh, issue and this is php my admin the mysql server you need to add mysql because uh, that is in the docker network so uh, docker default network it will automatically create it for every docker compose so you don't need to type localhost here you need to create my uh, type mysql the default username root and the password you go add it that's it uh, so now you are in php my admin the setup is working fine for the most part maybe some adjustments are needed on the go uh, 